Right. <clears throat> right, so this is the video that I'm going to produce for uh, for Gear 8 3. I'm going to show you a, an easy way how to get it done without needing any Legos. This is just to get up to the Mythic Gears, right? To get up to Mythic Gears. I'm going to show you what you need. It's not over the top. It's very simple. Right, we're going to go into Heroes first. The thing you're going to need is your Rangers, right? On this account, I've only got this many Rangers. It's not very many. Whisper with excitement. Yep, yep, I will try and whisper with excitement. This chick, to get to the Mythic, you're going to need, you're going to need her because she's lower in defense and she's quite, quite decent. I'm going to run through the gears, try and keep it as short as I can. Look, this stuff isn't, this stuff isn't great. Here's an attack bonus with attack underneath. This helps. This helps get an, get an attack bonus with an attack underneath. Really helps. You can rack the attack right up. Um, or you can go flat. At this stage, you can go flat and put an attack bonus underneath. If the higher this is, the better. Obviously, you want you want to rack it with as much attack as you can. <clears throat> Another uh, purple one here. Attack with attack underneath. Attack, attack. This set is 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 fine to get to mythic. It's fine. Trust me, it's fine. This, I just got lucky with this, look, this, 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 and this, it's, it's beautiful for this, but it racks it up. Here we are, look at the attack. 3700, 3743, plus 3743. Let's go back to the ones. Elucas is fantastic. Plus 3148. All you got to do is beat the numbers, right? Or get around to these numbers. Um... I've also got to mention about artifacts as well because I have actually got to the artifact stage and put some artifacts into plus 10 on there and there it does help just just to 10 it does help because you had you had this attack as well back to the gears over here look still got purples in still got purples attack bonus attack all this little bits help attack attack rack the attack up or oh, flat with the I mean this is ass I could improve on that no but no bother all right and I probably will, but I'm looking to go to Mythic now since I'm getting them, as you can see from the left. Um, a nice attack, just this set This set will be fine. If you've got gold and you've got the boost of attack, that's fine, but you've got to make the numbers. Plus three, plus, plus 3,000 approximately will help you. Uh, when it comes to Kook, you're looking at racking attack speed. The basic attack doesn't matter so much, although obviously the more you get, the easier it's going to be. Right? So, just have a look at this. Attack speed. Flat attack, crit rate. Right? It doesn't matter. This is in because it's got this bonus set of attack, which is great. Because that's still a good the percent. Right, that's 20% 20, 20 there. Um, the attack speed, 62. Go on to this one. Attack speed, 69. Everyone likes 69. That's the, the HP to keep them alive. And I explain why when I'm in the fight. Um, attack speed here. 20% of the purple up. We'll go on to this one. Attack speed. I don't I haven't seen any attack speed in the armor. So try and rack it with attack just to get like a flat attack and a, and a normal attack. This is a nice bonus. Uh, this actually works out, I think, more because of this flat attack. Um, there we go. Artifact. I believe he's on a, a 10 again. This guy helps not so much, but he does help. Um, you, you can bring him out at the end, and, and his ult helps, but he costs a lot. He costs a lot, which is the problem. But again, look, his artifact's not that much because this is this. He doesn't need this, but his stats are quite good. Um, his crit rate is over a hundred. Um, crit damage is plus thirty percent. But he, uh, you can you can probably make it without this dude, probably. But I'm just doing it because I may use him in the thing, um, showing you some of the gears. All flat, no, flat start, flat start, crit rate. This, this is there because of this massive boost here, which I got lucky on. Um, crit rate thing here. Look at the crit rate here. 18, 19%. This is very lucky to get this. You can use him. But the, the other units are, are probably a little bit better for this. Uh, this unit, again, if you can get her working, she's good. She's got a great big ult. Um, not a great unit. Not great. Look, this is not good gear. This is not good gear. I don't, don't even think she's got an artifact on. She, she hasn't even got one on. She's like insurance for me because I hadn't. I built the other ones first. Um, these ones are really useful. Really useful. Um, and I'll explain why they are useful for this stage inside the fight. You've got here um, a, a damage bonus set. doesn't really matter who's on, on that set, but it's about the attack speed for these dudes. So look, if you look at the attack speed here, plus 205. 
great attack speed there. Well, not super great, but like, if you get more attack speed than this, the more attack speed you have, the better these guys work. What I found so far. So a huge attack speed there. Look, and this doesn't this doesn't really matter. This really doesn't matter. What he needs is a lot of hit points. You can see the hit points at the top, and attack speed. It's a green, it's, you got to think it's a green unit. His his attack is never going to be that great anyway. But it's about the poison with these guys. Same for this dude. HP, but it's the attack speed of 82. What does it? These this is rack anyway. He's, 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 look at that plus 7,000. There you can just see it in the background. Here's another HP, but it got attack speed. Here's another HP, but attack speed. I think this got attack speed here as well. Uh, 53. I think this is just nothing. Look, it's nothing. <laughs> you could, you guys can beat this. If it, obviously the more attack it has, also, the better, the quicker you're gonna do it. But it's not about that. It's about this and this for survivability. Um, you could use this dude, but he's not as good as these two. Same type of thing would apply. Uh, I think he his skill is only his. Um, yeah, his ult that does the poison, which doesn't keep it up. So, in fact, what I'm going to do, I've already got it auto saved. So I'm going to, I'm going to, I'm going to put it on auto, and I'm going to comment on it how how it works. So here we are, stage ten done. We'll just do an auto fight, and you can watch it. Same as same as what I'm doing. Purple gear, purple gear. We like purple gear. So it comes out. We've got Kook on this side. I can't slow it down, I don't think, can I? I can't. Kook on this side. I'm going to pause it here, actually. He's going to tank, because what's going to happen is, when the boss pops out, she doesn't hit the front for some reason. I think it's set up for to hit the first person you put down. I might be wrong on that, but it always seems to hit this one, and this is the one I always put out first. Might be completely wrong. Don't quote me on it. Um, so he needs to be a bit tanky, which is why his hit points are quite high. Um, this uh, that's the frost dude. He can hold down this left side um, when, when he's got that plus 3500 attack. He can hold this side down. She's at the front for the death down. And this dude I'm just about to place is the uh, Screef dude, I think. Yeah, Screef dude. Level 35 with high HP. I put the healer here to get the boost to this this guy because this guy's got that rune that. Um, when someone's next to you, he gets a boost of attack. Now you can see it here. She's hitting this one on the side. We've got here, look, at the top here, you can just see the poison is at stacks of three. And it's got defense down. What this means with the poison at stack of three is each for each one of those stacks, she loses 1% of her HP every second, I believe. So at 3, she's losing 3%. And this is the reason why you want to put these on attack speed. Because you want to hit it as much chance as you can. Because it's only a 30% chance to, to hit. So you're hitting it constantly to keep the stacks up as high as you can. As long as you can. And, and you've got the HP because when the bombs pop out from her, the, the minions, you need to keep him alive. See how he's dropped off? You need to keep that up. Two, three, three. Because it will drop off and then you've got to restart again. Obviously, when the mobs come out, they take the hits, which resets it. Constantly hitting this side. I have got the 30% boost here, by the way. Because I've already done it. But these are all basic units. He's at the back for, for support. Like I said, you don't really need to use him. But there we go. It was do doable with the, without the 30% boost. And this is only your basic unit units like level 35. And uh, let's see what we just get here. Crit damage, crit rate. I mean, we'll take that. It's, it's gold, but I'm looking for mythic. But here we go. Let's look at these stats. Screef there with the one at the front with 24%. And he's only level 35. And, I, and, and you know, you probably don't need to take him past that because... If you guys have got better units, obviously they're going to work. Uh, but if you if you haven't pulled anything good and you really are struggling on gear A3, then this is a simple way to do it. 
with basic gear that anybody can get off, off the gold. And once you get to Mythic, you're laughing, right? You're laughing. So that's my basic way of getting through Gear Raid 3, stage number 10. And uh, I hope you have happy gaming.